It's time for Taste Appeal. I'm back with my co-hosts for the day, Mike Baxendale and John O'Brien. Baxendale O'Brien from Rock 102. Guys, so good to have you. And we're, of course, with the lovely Kathleen Delaney, owner of Great Grapes Catering. Hi, Ashley. Hi, and Hi, this guys. is Baxendale O'Brien. Hi, how are you? I'm so glad to see you in the flesh. I've spent the last 15 minutes boiling my tongue from that. <laughs> <laughs> from your cracker experience? Yeah, it didn't well, go this well. food will be a lot better. It. We can promise you that. So what are we making, Kathleen? Well, we're making my version of like a gourmet meatball that you don't even need sauce for. You don't have to have spaghetti none of this. This would be a great hors d'oeuvre. So I put um, sausage and um, beef, ground beef all in a bowl. Feel free to stir. Mm. It's very delightful. Okay. And then what we're going to do is we're going to put... Um, oh, that some, is delightful. Oh, isn't this that great? Is the mm. best will will you at least <laughs> eat a sausage since you I, wouldn't eat a cracker? I will eat sausage, absolutely. We're going to put... Here you go. Now you okay. can put this in, too. This is, what, is it, what do you think that is? Uh, it's mustard. Yes. Molasses. He's it's, not um, blindfolded grainy this time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Dijon mustard. Okay. And then, because what can I... Can I ever make anything without mustard? Everything you make is well, with trying Dijon not to, mustard. We're trying to do this leanly. So leanly, is that a word? Good. Um, you always make up words, and I love it. I know, but it works. So we, we're trying to do it so that it's not um, really, 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 really fattening. Okay. So we're going to put goat cheese in, which is our lowest. Uh -oh. um, no, yeah. goat cheese is delicious. Goat cheese is great. It's and awesome. It's oh, our, Brian, what do you, what do you think about goat cheese? How many, how many goats did they have to kill to get that much cheese? None, because it's from their milk. Oh, they don't, they don't kill oh. Them. No. So like, <laughs> there you go. And then I'm going to put some pine nuts in. Uh, Can I try one of those? Absolutely. And if you have a nut allergy, know that they're really not nuts. Yeah, they're like seeds. So they're good. They're, they're really not pine nuts. They're not nuts? Then why do they call them nuts? <laughs> Because that's they come off of the um, the acorn. That's what they, they do. do taste is that like the pine. Um, is that the medicinal marijuana I've been hearing about? <laughs> <laughs> or is that just? And then we stuff? have some herbs, <laughs> herbs um, that we're yeah. putting in. We're putting in some herbs. basil, so that, you can just rip that baby up for have, me. Have you ever uh, actually like sliced off the fingers in this uh, no. cooking segment? Not yet. Have you thought about it? Because I'll tell you what, that would make it really interesting. <laughs> I think if you if you cut one. Talk you're about talking. acting, huh? <laughs> oh my gosh. Now, do you guys cook at home? I, yeah. I do all the cooking at home. Really? I'll, I'll yeah. oftentimes uh, fold back. The aluminum. And, and <laughs> you have to keep the cobbler covered, though, or else it burns. Hard right. Work. Yeah. yeah. I thought you're good at that. Did you make your TV table? Yeah, uh, no, no, That's I bought gift, it. Eh? I bought it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. Wait. Well, so back to that. What else did you throw in I there? I just threw um, basil. Fresh basil from my garden, oregano, thyme, and a little bit of rosemary. Mm. We're gonna mix it all up. I Go thought ahead. we were out of time. Not, Not yet. yet. Somebody <laughs> kept saying we're almost out of time. <laughs> we're going to get that baby all mixed together. And the, the, the cool thing about it is if you're on a diet of any kind, there's no bread in this. There's You no, hear this? Mr. Yes. I really, won't eat a cracker. Yes. It's really, really a, a lean meatball as well. I mean, you know, mind you, you're having mm -hmm. sausage. But, um, but you got to have fat. Least, you gotta, yeah, you got to have fat. fat is, first out. of all, without fat, nothing is delicious. Exactly. And well without said. herbs. Says the fat guy. Right. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, all right, that's cool. That looks great. Right. So I'll get my hands dirty. Is that okay? okay? That's fine. So I'm, I would be making this for a, for, she does for a that cocktail a lot party, you, you know, so or, or, a, or an hors d'oeuvre, an appetizer. And what I would do is I would, I would slice up some cucumbers or some tomatoes or something and put it on a plate and, and then we'll get this baby going. And we will. Is that hot, Ash? Put hot, your finger on. Yeah, yeah, just, put your, just put your, put your hand right. Like, put your, put your palm right is down there on the bottom. Is a safe way to know? Yeah, yeah. You do. I think it's hot. There you go. I think it is. It's on. That's good. I've learned well. Oh, Kathleen, it's sizzling. You've taught me so well. I'm going to make a few meatballs <laughs> and like a half a pound of, of sausage and a half a pound of um, of ground beef and all these ingredients. They they take no time and they um they make lots and lots of meatballs. Are you just picking out the si the size of the, the meatball by? By I, eye you can and, do it and with, a, with a melon baller if yeah. you're that kind of person, but I can kind of figure out what, what kind size of person they are. uses a melon baller. Is it like, uh, a, like, is it like, a, like a personality <laughs> trait or is it no? A person who profiling? wants things that, that like is the OCD chef. That's ah, who it is. I yeah, see. But, okay. You know, it's, it, you know sometimes you, uh, they're good. Do you guys make meatballs a lot? I make meatballs. You sure. do? Oh yeah. So what how do you, do you make your meatballs? Uh, I I actually uh, <laughs> actually use a melon ball. No, so an ice cream really, scoop. Oh, you're that kind of person. I'll just uh, tear the bag open, <laughs> right. and then there's yeah. another bag that has the sauce in it, and I just pour them both. Together. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah that's I'm very good, good at that too. I actually I use a, I actually use a sausage because I used to use the bread, but right. then because the bread keeps it moist, and then I thought, well, if I added more fat, that'd be great. That'll make it moist, mm -hmm. just greasy. But it's not. It's at all. In yeah. fact, it's really, really good. And you cook it really? off. Well, if you put the, well, the mustard in, it keeps it together. Are you guys going to get your hands dirty and make some balls? She oh, said, you don't want me touching she, any of that. She said she wanted to do it right. to get her own hands well, dirty. Well, we're going to keep we're going to keep making these. <laughs> sure. How long Maybe. is that? Let them cook and don't move them until they're ready. Oh, my gosh. I'm getting yelled up. at. Kathleen, I'm so oh, sorry. Oh, no. I mean it in the nicest <laughs> way. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> don't all right, touch guys. We'll be back. We'll be back. Mass appeal. And we are in the kitchen. You got it. Look at them spears of meat.
Mm. <laughs> and they're very cheesy. They, too. they like they smell really good. I and, love uh, meat circles. Yeah, <laughs> those are some of the best things I've ever had. Delicious yeah. meat orbs. They're yes, meat it's, orbs. It's, 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 it's otherworldly. In a way, <laughs> planets really of is. meat. Yep, it really is. <laughs> How is the round meat as far as being almost done? It is being plated. Yes. In, in its new environment. Mm. See, that, 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 what that means is she's putting it on a plate. Does no. that mean? But well, you're putting to... it on a cracker. Uh, no crackers no. here. No, hey, no, no crackers. crackers here. We learned uh, the cracker lesson. Yes, we did, and now we are going to have a meat sphere lesson. Today, um, the beautiful thing is now you, you got to make a plate look nice. You know, you want the food to pop off the plate when you serve it to your friends. So I put it on some sliced cucumbers with some little tomatoes around the plate. And then now I'm going to top it with some, just at the very end, just finish it off with some Parmesan cheese. And there you have a mm. perfect little bite for your friends. And any time you want to try one. Um, uh, yeah, Meats. of course I do. I can just grab it. You can just grab it on the on the cucumber and go for it. Look at this. Will That's you be so offended cute. if I eat just the meat? No, thing? I won't be you, you won't, you won't put a cucumber in your mouth. Wait, no, you I you rat him about not yeah, eating a cracker, but you won't eat, eat a cracker. It's one slice of I'm, cucumber, O'Brien. Can I have several? Yes. I'm just kidding. I'll take one. <laughs> right. Oh, I was doing. Mmm. Mm. Oh, that's good. That's good. Oops. Right? It's really good. Oop. Lots of herbs. A little bit. Lots of cheese. But mm. not a, not a lot of filler, you know. So mm. it's all about it's all about the meat, and it's it's a really nice bite, I think. The pine nuts yeah. gives it a little texture. That's amazing. Yay! Oh, I'm so glad. Can you I have another one? Next, yes, please. Excellent round meat. <laughs> round <laughs> meat. Best round meat I've now, ever if had. If you don't like goat cheese, you could use okay. um, cream okay. cheese. You could use like you know borzan, any of those garlic kind of cheeses. I want to thank this um. goat for giving his life <laughs> up for us. <laughs> can you use like <laughs> like cheese in a can, like some nice cheese whiz like, or something? Easy like that? Cheese. You mean like queso? You can make a Mexican and put some queso. No, I, I was actually it? thinking like like cheese whiz or. Cheese. You know. No, yeah. I don't believe that's not really cheese. Sure, it's a it cheese is. food product. Yeah. You can't have that. Tell us more about your diet, Bax. I'm very bad. You can't eat easy cheese. Mm -mm. Okay, but you can eat meat and vegetables. Meat and vegetables, no. <laughs> Settle down. <laughs> Remember to deglaze the pan, not the guest or the host. <laughs> What's that? Some white wine. All right, well, we're going to keep eating these spheres of meat. There's one left. You and guys fight over you it.